not in terms of looking at art. I enjoy art fairs, I think, mainly because it's, it's a good moment to meet a lot of people in the field. It is art because it's quite a subversive concept. It is science because it uses science. And it really plays with all of our senses and philosophy, with our ethical sense. Well, certainly right now, our financial markets worldwide are concerned with other things than art because we have a credit crisis and a liquidity crisis. Um, but those who work in this thing and do well also have an interest in art. So yes, in boom times, more people get interested in art. The development of the visual arts themselves in that period have created a greater intimacy with popular culture and popular imagery and the entertainment industry than existed before. Tom, you're going to go down history as a pioneer of the museum world. How did the Abu Dhabi project come about? We developed a strategic plan and it basically called out for a Guggenheim presence in the Middle East and in Asia and uh, in Latin America and in Africa. I mean, Dora Maher told me once that Picasso said to her one morning, uh, I, love, I love that painting, my God, you're painting well. It's a wonderful painting, it's, it's, it's as good as a Cezanne. She was thrilled to bits the rest of the day. She's purring away to herself. Pablo thinks I'm as good as Cezanne. And that evening, over dinner, apropos nothing at all, because I suddenly said, I think Cezanne's full of shit, don't you? I need money to pay my rent, so that my gallery sell my work, so art fairs is a tool. I personally don't go very much to art fairs because it stresses me out.